Good morning, my precious one. I have a good news for you. Would you like to go to a dance party? But I have no dress to wear or jewelry. I'm afraid I can't go with you. Maybe you could borrow a jewelry from your friend without worrying. And let's get a new dress. So you think that's possible? Yes, it is. She will never be selfish to you. Hi, Mathilde. How exciting to see you again. Come inside and see. I'm great, Forest here. I just stayed home most of the time. Are you fine, Mathilde? It seems like you're not. What is that? Say it to me. Mm, I feel really shy to ask you for this, but my husband and I are both not going to a fancy party tomorrow. And I was wondering if I could borrow some. Is that all you need? Come on with me. I'll let you buy it. This jewelry will suit perfectly for you. I think this necklace really fits for me. It really looks good. Can this be the one that I will borrow? Sure, my dear. Anything you want. Um, wait. Let me put it in a pouch. Yes, Madame Forestier. It is I, Mathilde. You look like someone. Are you Mathilde? What happened to you, my dear? Are you okay? Yes, I am. Honestly, I am actually not because I am paying for the debt that we have. Remember the necklace that you let me borrow? I lost it. Return it. How come you lost it? We actually bought a new one for us to replace and return the necklace to you. So here we are, suffering because of the date that we felt very happy because of the fanzines that we were surrounded of that day. That day was really memorable and I regret every jealous and filthy ambitions that I had that day. I should have been contented with what I had. Good day, madam. It's 40,000 pounds. 